like each other, Paulie, dangerously. Well, after that accident, we saw from the battle Lyle, of course, they don't like each other. Larry Winters is not happy at all with the hitman, Tony Stetson. Stetson, after all, collected a contract on Winters. Larry Winters has got a chair outside the ring now. Whoa, wham, right on top of the head of Tony Stetson. And again. Well, I guess this is the type of action that Todd Gordon's going to keep his one eye on, huh? Unbelievable. Fans. Oh, drop of the neck of Tony Stetson down over that steel ring barrier. I've never seen Larry Winters this hot in my life, Paulie. Winters is absolutely out of control right now. Referee trying to get Larry back in the ring, but uh, he's not going anywhere without the hitman, Tony Stetson. In the ring, out of the ring, out of control, and now Larry Winters all over the hitman, Tony Stetson. Smart game plan by Winters, but he has to watch the count by the referee. Joking Tony Stetson down there on that middle rope. A nice boot to the head and a second, a third. What do you mean a nice boot to the head? A well-placed boot to the head, a vicious kick to the head. How can it be a nice boot to the head? What's the difference, Sully, between a nice boot and a, and a not nice boot? Wham, a punch right to the head, but beautiful rake in the eyes by Tony Stetson. Stetson firing back with a right hand. Well, this is an all-out brawl, and the referee obviously is gonna give both of these guys a little bit of slack because they want this feud settled here in the ECW. These two going toe-to-toe -to -toe here. Uh, Tony Stetson now some kind of throwing Larry Winters outside the ring. He's going to follow him outside, fans. Only bad things can happen outside that ring. Well, it's not a nice place to be on the hard concrete floor. There's a lot of added elements, and again now, the referee giving a lot of slack. Wow! Tony Stetson with a chair of his own, smashing Larry Winters over the head with that steel chair. Couple well-placed boots to the head, Paulie. See, that's a lot better. A lot of well-placed boots to the head. Now the referee. Whoa! What was that he hit Larry Winters with? Who cares? He's smacking them all over the place. It's like a soda can or some kind of can that he's picked up. Incredible! This thing's broken down completely, Paulie. Uh, I can't call this a wrestling match. Obviously, there are standing orders to let these two guys finish their feud off so that this kind of violence can stop here in the ECW. The referee giving a lot of slack to these two guys, but right now, Stetson rolling them over now, but doesn't go for the pin. He's using a blatant chokehold on his former partner. Whoa! Oh, Tony Stetson pushing the referee out of the way. We'll see what the ref has to say about that. That's a blatant uh, infraction of the rules there, Paulie. And now another referee comes down. Well, the second referee making his way to the ring here, fans. I don't even know if two referees can control this action. Whoa! Oh, he goes down again. Larry Winters this time pushing the referee out of the way. What are these two guys doing? Obviously, these guys are completely out of hand, and now there are two referees down there. And obviously, like I said, the unwritten standing order. Whoa! Oh, both men there momentarily back together, knocking down the referee. Oh! Here comes the second referee into the ring. Let's see what comes. No! Tony Stetson's big right hand knocks that referee down. And now it's gone too far. The third referee has called for the bell. You cannot put your hands on an official. On a, that's two officials that had their hands uh, put All right, there, you Paulie. can't put your hands on two officials. If the order stands for one, it certainly stands for two. Tony Stetson bringing Larry Winters down. Just, oh, there's the third referee that's taking a big right hand. Unbelievable. Here comes the wrestlers out of the dressing room. It's the Rockin' Rebel. Trying to break things up here. These two still, it's going to pull apart for all here. They're pulling Larry Winters away. Referee calling for the bell. Oh, they're holding him. They're not pulling him away. Hey, they're hey, holding right. him. They're holding him as Tony Stetson fires away with a couple big right hands. Oh, now the Rockin' Rebel. Axe is always trying to separate the two. Here's the Wild Man Sal Blomo. There's Iron Man Tommy Tyra. There's Glenn Osborne. Things are really out of control here, fans. Well, Sully, we got bodies all over the place. I don't know what the official uh, decision was in that match, Paul. They're Which going back at it. Unbelievable. Tony Stetson, Larry Winters, nobody, five guys can't tear these two apart. This feud isn't finished here, I don't think, Paul Lee. Look at this now. Winters going after the pants of the hitman, Tony Stetson. And now Belomo's losing his temper. We got a volatile situation here. Incredible, folks. Finally, we've got the two separated. Oh, but no, just as I said that, here comes Larry Winters diving outside the ring trying to get back at Tony Stetson. And look at Stetson showing that discretion is the better part of valor. He's getting out of there. Let him get paid to fight Winters again. 
Incredible fans.